Bosch. Let's move on to a couple skill positions right now. Let's talk about the skill positions. You had to replace a few kids on the outside, some guys that can make plays. Uh, and we saw a lot of guys make plays for us, but we're graduating three senior wide receivers. Let's talk about Tim Payne, number four here, 6'1", 165. Let's roll some tape. Heritage High School, Newport News. One thing I wrote down, jumps out on the film, just a pure playmaker, difference maker. Can run. Can run. <laughs> can run, right? He can run, coach. That's, that's, that's the first thing you say when you get in the meeting, you know, and you ask about the kid, hey, what can Tim do well, coach? He can run. <laughs> you know, and, and, it's, and it's apparent on the film. You watch him run away from guys. Sure. He's a track guy. He's also going to be involved with our track team right. while he's here, yep. which is really which exciting. Which was important to him. It was, it was the, the most important thing right. to him. He really wanted to be a part of it, and we got, to, got a chance while he was here for him to talk to our track coaches Excellent. and to uh, figure, learn about our, our program here. You know, he does the hurdles. The hunt, you know, so, yep. I mean, he's extremely athletic, has the ability to do everything we want him to do at the receiver mm -hmm. spot, but most importantly, he has the ability to run and take the top off the coverage. And, yep. you know, you're going to find out real quick whether or not that corner can run with him early in the game. Absolutely. And if he can't, we're just going to keep throwing it out there. Yeah, I mean, great body control, stride length. He just eats up cushion. He's a track now, guy. as a former DB, <laughs> I don't want to line up against him because he eats my cushion up so quickly. Either i got to bump him or I got to play so far off. So you can run the hitch to him, you can run the takeoff, you can run the, the sluggo route. I mean, these are things with that type of stride. I think he's an, you know, we always talk about receivers. Are they a one, are they a two, are they? This guy can be your number one receiver come, you know, down the road. I mean, you love to put him into the boundary and oh. figure out whether or not they're going to- Trips to the field? Yeah, and they're going to go one-on-one -on -one with him to the boundary yeah. and find out, okay, can this guy run with, can this corner run with him or not? And if they yeah. can't, we're going to make them get out of single hot. Yeah. We're going to make them get to a quarters coverage or a cover two where they're going to try to collision him at the line and get a safety over the top yeah. because, you know, now everything becomes cloud. Now you've got to find a way <laughs> to double that guy, sure. and now that opens everything up to the field. So. And it opens up your running game back into the bubble That's as exactly well right. when you cloud that type of stuff. A that cloud exactly basically right. meaning we're going to squat a corner and we're going to put a safety over the top. If they have to roll coverage like Trips, well, you saw it in the Super Bowl. We saw Trips to the field. We saw Zach Ertz into the boundary by himself, not a basically an X receiver, but that quick twitch fiber, he gets boom, runs a slant, catches it, gets into the end zone, which was a touchdown, by the way. <laughs> so, uh, but Zach Ertz did, did a great I think job it depends there. Depends on what state you're in, yeah. on whether or not that was a touchdown. You know, and I, the funny <laughs> thing is, when I heard about Tim Payne, and I said, them, somebody told me he ran a 4 14 1 7 and a 110 uh, high hurt. I don't know much about track. So I go to my track coach at my, my daughter's high school and I say, What's 14.17? He goes, Who ran that? Yeah. I go, well, We got a kid coming to Lafayette that ran that. He goes, Well, that's like a sub 1100. And I said, thank you very much, and I walked away. So I knew right away that that hurdle time is just something you can look at and say, wow, this kid's a track kid. Take the top off, right? There's no doubt. There's Perfect. no doubt. Going to major in finance and business. Long jumps to 22. So it's, wow. not just, it's not just the ability to run, eat up space, sure. right? He's got explosion. He's yeah. going to be fast off the line of scrimmage, yep. you know? So yep. it's big. Yeah, absolutely.